Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. My name's Maddie and I have two girls. One of them is five, the other one is three, about to be four next month. And I have one on the way. I am currently 39 weeks and five days pregnant. I will be trying to induce my labor tomorrow, but before I do all that, I wanted to show you guys the full nursery room tour, kids, kids playroom too. Um, yeah, so let's get started with that. Okay, so as you walk in, um, we have the king bed here. This is where the girls sleep, and sometimes I'll come in here and sleep with them, like whenever they wake up. Um, this uh, bedding is from Ross. I got it from there. It's a quilt. It came in like a three-piece. It's really cute. It had like the boho style. It said boho on there, so I thought it was cute. Decided to grab it. And um, up here I have this shelf that I got at Five and Below with um, a frame with Natalia's sonogram. And then I have that cute little crotcheted teddy bear. I got that on Amazon. And just two little random things I got. Just a little pink pumpkin and a planter. Over here, uh, we have the tassel. If you guys remember in my last video, I told you guys where I got that from. It's from Shein. And then up here, I got a poster, a rainbow poster. It is from Home Goods. Um, I thought it went really well with the theme. That's it for this part. And over here at the end of the bed, I have a Moses basket. Uh, if you guys remember, this is from the Shein video too. I had an extra one, so I just put it on there. I'll show you guys what I did with the others. Um, over here is just her blanket swaddled blanket and uh, her hat with the headband uh, I'll probably be using these for like a photo shoot that I have scheduled not sure yet and then I got a binky so yeah that's that on this bed I'll be using this for when she lounges around I don't want her to fall off the bed or anything I do have a personal bassinet thing in my room in the other room i can show you guys if you guys are interested but um this is just like to carry her around or like move her from the living room to the room so over here i changed the curtains out to white ones they were gray i got these curtains at ross they were like calvin klein brand which they look really nice they're blackout curtains, apparently, but they don't really look like it. Over here, I have this rocking chair. It is from Wayfair. It's really nice. It's really comfortable. I definitely recommend this chair. Um, it also has like a side pocket. I have two burp rags in here. And over here on this wall, I know you guys remember this one from the Shein Hall. It's just a poster with the ABCs. Really cute. And I paired it with that. And over here is the girls dresser. Not much going on here. Um, just, you know, uh, Stella's clothes and then Elena's clothes and then just just their clothes not much to see in the tv we got the tv here i forgot to take those off i'll probably i'll probably take them off um over here i have the diaper caddy um 
I can show you guys what I have in it real quick. I'm not gonna go into full detail about everything that's in here, but I got this diaper caddy off of Amazon. It's at a really good price too, for like $10, and it's really, really big with a lot of pockets, a lot of storage. It even came with like a crossbody thing if you wanna carry it around, but I'm not doing all that. Uh, over here I have a whole bunch of sample sized wipes. If I could get it to open. A whole bunch of sample sized wipes from the free baby registry if you watched my other video. And um, up here I have her newborn diapers, some bibs that I have to wash, some lotion, mittens and gloves, some medicine, gripe water medicine, butt paste, applicator, and just other things that you might need to get around when you have a newborn. That's it for over here. Over here I got this projector. Um, I will have to show you guys a clip of when it's on at night. So here it is on. It also, it's Bluetooth and you can like connect it. It's really, really cute. It also has a whole bunch of like um, films to change it with. Like you can change out the films. I have like a unicorn, Christmas, happy birthday one. But yeah, this projector is really cute. And I only got it for $7 because I follow a couponer. Over here we have the Mama Roo. Um, I bought this insert off of Amazon. I was going to buy the Mama Roo one. But honestly, $35 just doesn't seem like something I want to spend on an insert. So I found this one for like $17, $16 with the discount. Um, it looks really nice. It's like really plushy, very plush. And yeah, just your regular Mama Roo. Just over here. And I wanted to show you guys the carpet. This is the carpet. I just really feel like a carpet brings out the room. Like, it looks nice. It makes the room look bigger, in my opinion. I got this rug off of Amazon. It was on sale for like $85 after tax and everything. I think I got a pretty great deal. It's a eight times 10, but to me it looks bigger. It seems like they almost sent me the wrong size, but I'm not complaining. It's a yellow color rug with patterns. It's really beautiful. You can't beat the price. I believe they did go up in price last time I checked, but I will still link it down below for you guys to check that check that out. Just a quick overview on this side. Here's what it's looking like. Move on to this side of the wall. So on this side of the wall, I have a coat hanger thing accordion thing I got this off of Amazon uh, very inexpensive um, over here I have a Lilo and Stitch baby I got this in Oklahoma when we went on our trip decided to get it for Natalia because I wanted to bring her a little souvenir back you know um, over here I have a little camera little fake camera it came like that I'm not sure why but I got this one on Amazon and this is a teddy bear hat it came with that little teddy bear it's like a photo prop thing that I'll probably be using or something 
And if you guys remember, again, from my video, my last video, I showed you guys this one. Uh, it's a rainbow. I got it off Shein. And over here, I just uh, twisted up a blanket, two blankets. I thought it looked cute. It looks nice. Um, that's it for this. And over here, I have the this floating shelf that I got off Amazon. It came in a set of two. Uh, a few decors on it. Uh, this one's from Marshalls. They're both from Marshalls. It's really cute. That's a cute touch to it. And moving on to this side. This side is the best part of the room. Um, the wallpaper I purchased off Amazon. It came out great. It looks great. The picture frames are from Amazon. Well, not the pictures. The pictures are from Etsy, but the frames are from Amazon. There are 11 by 14s. And the wallpaper is looking great, looking nice. And here's uh, the other floating shelf. Decided to put it right here. Two more days left. Before my due date, this is from TJ Maxx. The TJ Maxx. This is from Hobby Lobby. That flower, this is real. This is a real flower. I've been having it for uh, quite a while. Succulent, not a flower. Um, yeah, that's that for, this is like our accent wall. And over here, we got her crib. Uh, you guys remember uh, the video where I'm setting up the baby's crib and um, put the bed sheets on. These are for, this sheet is from Amazon and the pillow is from Target. The dollar spot, but it was $5. This Squishmallow, we just been having it. I thought it looked cute because, you know, it has gold, glitters. Matches the theme. This is only for decor purposes. I will not have anything in here when she's here. And over here we have the blanket. And over here we have the baby's mobile. I just have it on a piece of twine with a little hook at the top. And yeah, it looks, it's actually better than I thought it would look. I had originally seen a mobile on Amazon for like $25 I was gonna get, but this was very inexpensive and cheap, and it looks beautiful. So down here is all her clothes. Down here I have her baby socks, some mittens, uh, her hats, her baby bows. Her newborn clothes and over here on this side we got the her zero to three month clothes swaddlers sleeper sacks some more sleeper sacks over here I have some burp rags along with some binkies and her pacifier pacifier holders uh, that's pretty much on that yeah, it looks, I know it's not gonna stay like this, but I wanted to show for the video just until she's here. This is the last spot that I started doing stuff on. This is the closet. I turned it into a little play area. So over here I have just like some sensory toys, blocks and stuff like that. Um, 
not much going on here just their toys that they play with whenever they're bored over here is their kitchen they've been having this kitchen for a while now uh, the rug is from five and below I was originally gonna use this rug for something else but I'm just like you know what I'll put it here so I put it here and it looks great and um, these are from Hobby Lobby I was originally gonna use them for storage for the baby stuff but it didn't work out how I wanted it to so I just put it on top of here as a cute little like decor stuff over here I have a play all day sign um, I printed this off of Etsy and the frame is from Amazon it came in a pack of five with these these were so cheap I got them for really cheap um, over here I have this little cloud person it, um, sleeping awake kind of thing this is from Hobby Lobby um, over here I have a let's read sign with some Ikea shelves and some books I actually did put extra leftover of the wallpaper just to like use it up because this wallpaper was quite expensive and these books I recently got them I got them on Amazon thought it was cute because we're in the month of October and it just seems to fit well here that is it for this one this basket is from Ross you guys probably remember in the video that I posted if you guys watched it it's from Ross and it was really inexpensive too I just put all their stuffies in there but that is pretty much everything I'll show you guys a quick overview of how everything looks on this side play all day so yeah, that is it for the nursery reveal tour, shared room, everything looks so nice, I love the way it turned out, I'm very proud of it, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below, like should I add more things, I think I did pretty good, this is my favorite. I hope you guys enjoyed this video um, don't forget to like comment and subscribe um, that is it for this video I will try to link as many things as I can down below um, hopefully my next video will be labor and delivery because yeah I literally have two days left or one more day until my due date and since I'll be inducing my labor um, just one more day basically so yeah um, thank you guys for watching till next time bye